After exporting from the GeoTag software, we can actually open up this KML in Google Earth. And I'm um, going to go ahead and navigate to that and go ahead and open that file. And you can see once we open it, Google Earth starts zooming into the location. And what you'll notice right off the bat is that there's only one picture, and that's because we need to go ahead and change the time slider up at the top of the window. And you'll see that once we separate these two endpoints, all the pictures start to show up. And if we zoom in a little further, we can see that when we click on uh, click on these pictures, they actually pull up pull up the image. And when you click on the image, it actually pulls up the picture. Now we see all the images here, but uh, it might be helpful to actually see our, our track data. And since we have the, the data for that, there's the, uh, I'm going to navigate to that GPX file that we had to create earlier for the GeoTag software. And Google Earth can also read that file. And now we see the overlay of the track for the entire field course. Um, and GPS recorded data for, uh, the GPS logger recorded data for the whole the whole 10 day field course and this is uh, the blue track is is everywhere we went so you can see the pictures line up pretty nicely with that track